the ACS Industry Insights Leaders Series, featuring Australia's foremost business leaders, discussing burning tech issues shaping our future. Innovation in the digital economy. What's the old saying? Necessity is the, uh, the mother of invention, right? And you're seeing many, many small businesses doing some phenomenal things to pivot, innovate, and change the orientation. I've also seen small companies that were nimble, um, uh, innovative in and of themselves um, and have been able to move rapidly to put themselves at the front of, of, of a new economy. So many failed projects failed simply because of a change of people, a change of focus, not because it was not able to be done. And it's very easy to come into something half done and declare it crap and let it go. I do think the single most important thing that Aussie startups need is we need other successful Aussie startups. Be customer-led in a changing world. You're asking the wrong question about what, how would I use technology to disrupt you. The only way that technology works is to actually solve customer pain points. So what I would do is I'd come and look at where are customers most in pain when they deal with you as a company. How do we continue to interact with our customers in a new digital way uh, that is going to create a differentiating edge moving forward? Think about the customer. Put the customer at the centre of what you're building. Test it. See what they think. Change it. See what they think. Change it again. So the whole point here is the days of creating monolithic products are over. Get buy-in from a company board. Finding the compelling reasons, finding the compelling return, talking the language of the board in terms of the, the capital value of your company or the, the efficiency that will yield better profitability and finding those things to invest in. If you're going to take something that's quite bold and ambitious around technology and innovation, it's a step process. Um, it, startling boards and surprising them or doing things that are highly, have high risk and, and haven't had a lot of um, taking people to, through that process can typically be very difficult for boards to, to jump into. Um, and good boards never want to become managers or interfere and step into the role of the chief executive and the management team. And so you want to play that, that role carefully to ensure that what you're giving them is enough confidence to back the management team. Prepare for skills in the future of work. We've all seen great ideas with the wrong people turn into nothing, but average ideas with exceptional people turn into global rock stars. Thinking about those essential skills that we need young people to have. So good ethics, good decision making, um, the basic foundations of being able to, um, to conduct ourselves across a society. Um, and then understanding where technology and understanding digital capability sits and how we get that learning. Every industry is becoming digital every industry and so I think there's going to be a talent shortage uh, for a long long time to come. Become an expert. I think that's the biggest thing I'd say is become an expert. Don't, don't you know, be inquisitive, uh, compare yourself to the best. Uh, don't just cruise along, don't just be good enough. Discover what an ACS membership can do for you. Find out more.